Hi, my name's Tom, and I'm a noob, a jerry. See, I've only been writing for six months, and that's just not enough time to shroup nah. But when an opportunity presents, you've got to jump on it. So the challenge was set. Can a noob with just six months writing experience conquer the world's most famous mountain bike trail? Whistler's A-Line. Oh, well, hey noobs. I am walking down to Whistler Bike Park as we speak and I'm bloody excited, let me tell you. It is a beautiful day, there's a few clouds around, but it's crispy blue sky. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna do is just put on the chin mount to start with so I can give a bit of commentary on my first reactions to the trails. So I've got a feeling after watching a bunch of GoPro footage of this, I've got no idea what's ahead of me. Whoa! <laughs> Everything hurts. Okay. How's the weather be? Get it. <laughs> wow! That was much bigger than I expected. First time ever on a downhill bike. Wait! <laughs> Sick. The surface is nice up here. Whoop. See? Oh, it gets pretty bumpy. Whoa, foot slipped off. That was pretty scary. Right, might take it easier. Just while I get used to this bike. These berms are pretty slippery. They're not that big, so you gotta be careful. So, I mean, most GoPro footage makes crank it up seem pretty tame, but this is some of the biggest jumps I've ever done. In my six months of mountain biking. So, <laughs> this is crank it up. Entry level jump track. I cannot wait to see a line. Gee, my fingers are hurting already. I'm holding on too tight. <laughs> I'm a bit scared. <laughs> These are pretty big already. A little double. Whoa! <laughs> it's huge! I'm gonna remember to pump nice and early on these massive ramps. Ever in. I'm gonna get to know. This is awesome. So I won't lie, after this first lap, I was a little disheartened in a couple of ways. Firstly, the jumps were just so much bigger than I thought. So I was terrified at the thought of what A-Line must be because I knew they were so much bigger than these and I wasn't sure I'd be able to do it. So that was kind of annoying. And secondly, I just hurt all over instantly. My back, my lower back was screaming at me. My arms were tired, my hands hurt and I was regretting that I hadn't worked on my strength more before the trip. So you will definitely benefit from working your core, getting good core strength, good upper body, arms, that kind of stuff is just gonna be such a benefit in a bike park like this. GoPro stop recording. Now these shots are from a little later in the day. This is Seymour, which is an extension of Crank It Up. The jumps are a bit bigger, uh, the berms are a bit bigger, everything's a bit bigger. But gosh, they just feel so good. They're so smooth. You just, the confidence you get from them is amazing. 
So it really is such a perfect place to be working on your jumping skills, getting that compression as you go into the lip and then releasing at the top. What I was finding is that I had the mentality that I was launching my body and, and sort of timing it as if I was just jumping off the bike. Um, but then, of course, you take the bike with you. But having that attitude about your weight really helped to control your balance in the air. Uh, I don't know if that's something that most people do or not, but it worked for me, and then I felt really confident. Um, I'm starting to whip the bike around, yeah, get some real style in the air, which is great fun. So, you know, maybe I can do this. Maybe I can uh, work my way up to A-line before the trip is over. Feeling really nervous now because I'm going to try A-line. Um, I've been talking to a lot of locals and regular visitors and they are too scared to hit A-line. So I feel like I'm a bit silly because I've only been riding for six months. <laughs> Uh, so this is A-line through the eyes of a noob. Ah! I'm feeling bloody nervous. I'm just gonna do it. I'm strapped up. Got my um. Uh, I don't know. What am I saying? I don't know. I'm too nervous to talk. You don't want to hear me talk anyway. You want to see me stack? Oh my gosh! This is A-line. <laughs> How big is this drop actually? Look at that, look at that, whoa, fast and bumpy. What happened? I don't know. Whoa, it's freaking huge. Oh my gosh. Look at these guys. Yeah, that was pretty big. That was the small bit. I'm all going after these little guys. The little shredders. All right. That's all right, I can do that. And that. Okay, this is smooth. The G, pick up speed. Oh, it's huge! Whoa! All right. Mustn't forget to pump properly. Whoa! Even if my nerves... Oh, taste that. Let me lose my technique. I'm gonna die. Pump infection. Oh, I'm going to do a little one. Alright. Oh, it's huge. Oh. <laughs> That's not for man. Oh, it's not a good then oh, these birds are getting bumpy 
find it hard to keep the speed going. insane. There's speed you're getting through there. That drop you just pick up so much speed and that's not even the drop. Alright. Cleaned my pants. Put a new set of undies on. And we'll go continue our merry adventure down A-line. Just in case of them, I'm going to be carrying more speed. Oh, yes. Oh, oh bumpy burn. Holy crap, what is this? Whoa. Oh, shit. I mean, oh, gosh. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. That was amazing. Oh my gosh! I'm alive! Oh, lucky I brought lots of undies with me. That was huge! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Go, bro, stop! Oh, wait. Okay. <sighs> Alright. About to hit the tech section of A-Line for the first time. I'm a bit nervous because I'm not good at tech and I don't really know just how hard this is. So, there's a pretty big jump just around here. I need a bit of speed. Here it is, it's nice. It's nice. Okay, pretty smooth down here. Oh, bumpy. Here we go. Oh, it's tight. That not too tricky. <laughs> okay. Let's hope there's no major drops that take me off guard. Ooh. All right. Oh, yes. That's it. Oh, oh my gosh, that's good. How good is that? I mean, what a trail, what a line. It's 52 jumps, I think, and each one of them is just spectacular in its own right. They're all unique, they're all special, they're all brilliant. And I did it, I got to the bottom in one piece. So yeah, I'm pretty stoked about that, but it's left me with the challenge of those two jumps. The huge moon booter, which that face of the jump is enormous. It's just terrifying. You've got to just stop yourself from hitting the brake. So I need to do that. And the last jump as well. If I can clear those two jumps, which were just terrifying, I will feel like I've completed A-line. But I don't want to push my luck just yet. So I might explore the rest of the park first. Oh yeah. So everyone's telling me I need to try Angry Pirate. Because I've been after a bit of flowy tech and all I've been doing is A-line and everyone's like, no, you're gonna do Angry Pirate, mate, no Angry Pirate. I'm like, oh, I'm no good at tech. I'll oh, do Angry Pirate. And I've got to the top of Angry Pirate. Turns out it's black diamond. Um, I had a fall on a blue diamond yesterday, a uh, blue tech trail yesterday. <sighs> so I'm really nervous, but I'm gonna give it a go. See how we go. I'll take you for the ride. I'll take you all. All right. Okay. 
It's pretty snooty. <laughs> pretty tanky. Okay. I almost lost it there already. And I reckon that's not black diamond territory yet. So let's see what is ahead. Okay. It is still nice with some booze. Ooh. It's slowly than nice worms. Oop. A little bit of a drop. There we go. Oh, slippery. Oh my god. Oh, shivers. Whoa. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. I hope that's the worst of it. Oh, whoa, pedal strike. This <laughs> sick. Oh. oh, yes. That's awesome. Ah, oh, it's blue for the rest of the trail. All right, that can be blue. A lot of people coming. There you go. That was so good. I can't believe I did that big roll. Oh, this is rad. It's just so flowy. There's little gaps here and there you could take. You could take. I'll just leave them. Boca Vista, that's it. Sounds like what they were saying. Apparently you can boost if you... Oh, that's good. This is just a green one, so... Feeling a bit more confident. And back onto easy, does it? That was sick! Oop, back off here into the next part of Del Boca Vista. Yeah, I can throw it around these corners. Way more confidence. I don't know what's coming up, but it's green. It's nice though here. Beautiful time of day as well. Uh, this way. You could spend a really long time exploring this park and never feel like you've seen it all. There truly is something for everyone. The flowy tech and loamy goodness is incredibly satisfying to throw yourself down. But let's stay focused on our primary objective, which of course is nailing A-line. You going, mate? Oh, go ahead. Cheers. All right. <laughs> Back on A-Line. Done a few runs now, so I'm feeling a little more confident. So if ever I was gonna stack, probably now. So see if I've got the balls to send the big moon booter. And the final one as well, that's my goal right now. If I can clear those two, then I think I can say I've officially done a line. Woo! Very good! Oh man, this is amazing. Clear them, otherwise I'm not going. Okay, let's 
save the arms a little bit through here. Here it comes. Go up there. Back down. There it is. To the moon, there we go! Oh my god, that's terrifying. It's so good. Into the tech section. I'm getting more confident at. Going faster. More likely to crash. Consequence is fairly high here as well. If you're stuck, you're gonna roll down a mountain. It's so tight. I can't believe I just did that moon booter. Oh my gosh, that was big. Because you're in the air forever. All right, no brakes. Oh, this drop is big. Here we go. <laughs> ah, just watching that back gives me chills. You really have no idea of the speed and scale from these GoPro shots. The foot cam here is the best I could do, but honestly, the confidence these beautifully crafted jumps give you to launch yourself over 40 to 50 foot jumps is it's just mind-blowing. It's the best. A line of course and let me tell you every time it just it gets better and better as you get more familiar with it and sure there's a heck of a lot of hype around it and it lives up to every bit of that and oh, beyond it's just amazing so I am so happy with what I've achieved this trip I've done more than I thought I'd be able to do and I'm in one piece the bike is in one piece it's been quite an adventure so I've got heaps of footage from the few days here so look out for the links for that as I make other edits and have fun how do you sign off I don't know bye